This is part of the broadcast where I tell you a little bit about my personal news, about what's going on in my life. Obviously, a lot of you want to know because yesterday I ended the broadcast with a lot of people at my house. Will knew exactly how to shop for a 32-year-old man, just shop for a 16-year-old boy. Yeah, it's true. I mean, I got a lot of incredible gifts. We'll, we'll go through them in a little bit. Folks, 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 folks. This is part of the broadcast where I tell you a little bit about my personal news. So let's talk about it. What happened yesterday? So a bunch of people came to my house. Or a decadent Korean meal. Not, not a succulent Chinese meal, but a succulent Korean meal. Uh, we did KBBQ at my place. Okay, we did we did Korean barbecue at my place. And honestly, it was great. Shouts out to Ray for uh, setting all of that up. She is the birthday goat across the board. I mean, it was incredible. Does Ray always go crazy for people's birthdays? Yes, she is, she is like, she is the birthday queen. Like, she is so good at... I mean, this is like above and beyond. I've never had anything like this. This is like an insane experience, uh, honestly. I'm not a very big birthday boy myself. You guys already know. And like, I get really awkward as you guys probably saw on stream. But um, yeah, no, it was insane. It was incredible. Uh, shouts out to Emily as well, obviously, for setting all of that up. The ending of yesterday's stream with everybody singing happy birthday was so wholesome. It fucking <laughs> broke me a little bit. But yeah, um, last night I ended the broadcast. A bunch of uh, friends came over. Some normie friends, some streamer friends, some friends that are, uh, you know, in the industry. And uh, yeah, we, we shot a bunch. Uh, March was uh, on the camera and he shot a bunch of footage. So we'll probably make a vlog out of that. Uh, if Austin Ox will make a vlog out of that, it's, you know, it, it'll happen. It'll happen one day. Copium. Um, probably. But did you vlog cutting into the Kai cake? I did. Yes, we did. It was terrifying and scary. And Kai had been real quiet since Austin had cut the cake. Yeah. Um, the meal was incredible. It, it was delicious. It was great. I've never had an experience like that in my entire fucking life. Uh, you know, it just, I, I, I feel unworthy. You know what I mean? I just, I feel unworthy. I don't feel like I deserve it, but this no, 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 but this is the one part that was like genuinely and legitimately traumatic where myth actually cut Kaya. Uh, that, that cake is, is actually way too fucking realistic. Okay. That cake is way too fucking realistic. I couldn't do it. I like literally cut like a toe. I couldn't do more than that. How are you going to keep all these gifts in this room? Uh, no, I'm just going to show you what I got. Uh, and then that's it. Myth almost shot the chef too. Yeah, he's a bit of a menace. It's crazy. But in any case, nobody even ate the cake. Like, we couldn't even eat it. You need to hang up the gift Ray gave you? I know. So, you know, they came over. We had a incredible, we had an incredible meal, some laughs. I, for the first time ever, had uh, a unfiltered sake, which I realized is like, a lot better than filtered sake. I don't know why the fuck they even filter sake. Now that I've had the unfiltered version, I'm like, yo, that shit is great. I mean, dude, I just, I don't know. I don't, I don't deserve my friends and family. That's how I feel. Like, is Turkish ice cream good? Yeah, no, it's incredible. Turkish ice cream is so good. How are your ribs now? Uh, my rib is fine, but I woke up with like some minor back pain. Not like the end of the world. It's not the worst, but it's a little bit of back pain. I have a little bit of throat pain right here and, and a little bit of a headache, but it's okay. I mean, that's what it is. It is what it is. Um, am I falling apart? No, not at all. How was the orgy last night? It was incredible. Um, you know, Ludwig threw it back. He is so overzealous. He's such an overzealous bottom. It's crazy. He threw it back for everybody. I was like, Lud, stop. <sighs> Where was I? Anyway, um, yeah, the, the, the event was great here. We'll, we'll, we'll cover the, we'll, we'll, I'll show you what I got. Um, let's, let's get into it. So first and foremost, Will got me a Daniel Defense uh, Mark 18. You guys know that already. I showed you guys this already. Like every part of the gun is is basically a, uh, it's it's the same, except it obviously has uh, it obviously has uh, airsoft rounds instead in its magazine. Um, so that was the first uh, that was the first gift. Second gift was from Valkyrie, who uh, got her thumbnail artist to make this incredible, absolutely beautiful painting, which I will be hanging up, obviously. Uh, it's massive Godzilla Kaya in Japan. I'm in a samurai armor with a Turkish flag on it. All right, second thing, uh, or I guess second thing was the, the masterpiece that I just showed you guys with the wallpaper. I'm trying to figure out a good way to, a uh, good place to put this because it's massive. 
I tried uh, I tried putting it somewhere this morning and it like it just simply did not fit. Um I also got the uh <clears throat> the LeBron James like leg thing. What is it called, chat? Myth got me uh the LeBron James leg thing. The leg compression thing. It's like a like a leg sleeve kind of and it compresses and it wraps your leg. Thera body recovery air, is that what it is? I mean it's like right here. I don't know why I'm asking you guys. Yeah, recovery air pro. Marat got me this one final gift that I'm going to show you guys, and then we're going to get to the news, okay? Marat got me this massive Pelican case, and I was like, what the fuck is in this? Like, this is huge, and it's very heavy. I don't know what's going on. It's a Pelican case, which is like a professional case, right? For, I guess, uh, for like music equipment and stuff like that. It, and uh, what you're supposed to do, apparently, is put it down like this. And it opens up. And there's a fucking key light in it. I was like, what the hell is this? A Go XLR Pro, a keyboard, a mouse, a, uh, a key light. And then he was like, hey, pull it up. See what else is in there. An Asus, Asus monitor. And then you pull it up one more time and there's another Asus monitor. And then underneath it, a whole bunch of cables and whatnot so that I can, if I want to, travel with a case where I can just basically professionally stream with the same exact setup that I have off of a gaming laptop anywhere around the planet. So yeah, Marat wanted to give a gift, not only for myself, but also for the entire stream. I'm a Marat expert. Actually, Marat will give people that exact gift when they want to be taken to Japan again. Oh, that's cr <laughs> You're a Marat expert, huh? Uh, you forgot to mention that it's waterproof. So when the plane crashes, you can stream and give us the news from an island. W Marat. Yeah, but it's crazy.